So, I actually did not know this existed for a very long time. Um, I actually really, really liked the It movie, and I never knew there was an action figure for it. Never knew. And so I'm doing an action figure review right now. I just got off of this. I just got it from an Amazon box, you know. And I'm really excited to open this up. So, um, as you can see, it's in a little wrapping. That's good. So the box doesn't get any scratches. I don't do this, but a lot of people do like um, keeping it just in the box. So you know, yeah. Um, there's this little tab. Um, so, I kind of like that, I don't know, it just makes me feel like it's more like, I don't know, like, a well done, like, professional in a way, you know what I mean? And, yeah, so we're gonna be opening this thing up. So, I'm guessing we just pull this tab right here, well not tab, but, we just pull it. Because you, you don't really care about the wrapping. So we're just going to like tear it, I guess. <clears throat> okay, got it. Um, so this is going to be an in-depth review. Um, I'm going to try and be as in-depth as possible. Just so, um, um, just to be a little bit different. So yeah, this is, uh, I'm glad because this is actually pretty high, uh, quality. Yeah, I guess you could say. <laughs> oh, that looks awesome, doesn't it, guys? Doesn't that just look awesome? You can see a little ground. That, Georgie. Um, it, the red balloon, you know. You'll float too. Oh. Uh, and it's of course made by NECA. NECA is, I really like NECA. If you come for any um, action figures, uh, they're decent, but when it comes to like the horror action figures, amazing, only go for these guys. <laughs> I'm serious. So you got him in like a weird like, shh, he's like shushing you, I think. It's really cool. And you know, you got his face, you know, it in writing, looking really cool. And then this is him and actually in different poses. At first glance, you just think, oh, it's it. And it's like, no, it's the action figure. I mean, you can obviously see that. It's just right out of the box. You're like, uh, oh. So that's how many, he has multiple faces. Um, and yeah, the box is looking really nice. If you go right here, it says it of course and seven friends engage in a struggle with a demon they first encountered 30 years earlier in their main hometown so what's w one thing is this is like an action figure for the sequel even though the sequel hasn't come out that's that's what it sounds like that's the one little mistake i'm catching it's kind of weird <laughs> but um yeah for me the box is a little little bit open but, come on, I don't mind that at all. So we're just gonna, oh, it's Velcro. Ooh, nice. We got it right here. Ooh. This is looking nice. So, we got him. He's looking tilted, his head's tilted. And this is amazing for people who just like displaying, like amazing. Um. We got his hands, we got his, uh, this hand to hold the balloon, as you can see right there. We got, um, the boat. We got, basically, he has three faces. A completely average face, just like, yeah. We got his, uh, t tilted, like, creepy face, and then this is his, uh, I'm going to kill you face right now. Currently, I'm chopping... I am eating you. That is his face for that. Um, and yeah. So I really like this Velcro. As you can see, it's one piece. One piece right here. One piece right there. Wow. And then... So I really like that. So you can keep it in the box. You can take it in and out. 
Yeah. So I think if you want to take it out, you just open. If if you want to take it out, you just open the box. I'm trying to be very very careful with this because I might put it back in the box. But there's tape right here, so you just want to get some scissors. Mm. And cut. There we go. There's just one piece of tape. I don't know if it's different for you guys. Maybe there's two pieces of tape, but that doesn't really matter. <laughs> and wow. So if I were you, I'd really try and keep this in condition. You might be able to just slide it back in, because I know you can put this part back in. The this part. So it's it. And I just slid it open. I just get my hands going like this. There's two little tabs right here. Um, and there's this where you can hang it. And um, now let's just slide it out. Whew. I'm really excited for this one, guys. So this just comes off immediately, right? And it, this is so cool, right? It's like a background set right here. And this is of the uh, creepy house thing in the movie. It's really all I can say. The creepy house thing. So if you want, I'll, tur I'll turn on the light so you guys can see us just a little bit better. Um, yeah, that's the house. Um, so you can display figures in front of it. Hey, we got uh, Captain America at the Ed house. There you go. But... Oh my god, let's open this up, guys. Um, yep. I think you guys know how to open this up. Oh my gosh, I have a lot of things to talk about this figure. Opened it up. You may realize it's not really in a cool pose. That's because, well, you'll see. I think this figure is amazing and also horrible. I'm not joking. This was, I'd say, the biggest point to being a perfect action figure. Almost so close to being an amazing action figure. And you might be like, why? This is looking amazing. Um, I couldn't tell, but you can literally not get the hands on here. The way I had to take off the hands, and this is the right way to do it, is to get a hair dryer, heat it up, and then take it out. But you cannot, and you might be like, well, this is in. I literally took the least amount of force, and it came out. Naturally, if you just go like this, you know, just move it slightly. If you do any posing or whatever, oh, it's, it's, it's gone. It's fell fallen off the hands are one of the most important parts and I had a hair uh, hair dry the head too to take it off so this is my literally my only complaint but uh, it's a huge like <laughs> if I were you if you get this I'm not even joking just leave the hands like it's it's my action figure but which i'm pretty sure it isn't and i think you should just leave the hands on that has on right now or you're, you're prepared to be in a huge mess <laughs> just get ready prepare yourself if you get this i just got this on amazon and searched it action figure um okay so uh, with that complaining out of the way let's go and start the video so, um, well, it's starting this part. And I'm just gonna leave the hands out because, uh, I I'm, I'm not dealing with that. I haven't put the hands in correctly once. And it's, well, you might think it's just me. I've tried everyone in my family. Like, hey, can you try this? Can you try this? No one can do it. Ah. Uh, so, um, as far as standing, it stands alright. I feel like the feet could be a tiny bit bigger. I mean, uh, right? Like, is that just me? Maybe a little bit. Um, and as far as looks, though, do you realize how this is a little? This looks messed up, right? In the movie, you look at it. It's it's uh the line of the uh, I don't want I don't know what it's called. Like the little 
these are out of line. That's exactly how it looks. Uh, so this is an amazing display figure. It looks amazing. Um, almost perfect. <laughs> and it stands okay. I wish the feet were a little bit bigger. Um, he's got a pedicle right there. So yeah, let's go over articulation. So, well, first of all, the accessories are a boat that says SS Georgie. Um, he has a serious face. Um, let me take this off. Um, it can be a little bit hard to, like, literally, I had a hair dry it for the first time. Um, this actually comes off of him, so if you want a little bit more head articulation, just take that off. It's a little tip for you. And, let me, so there's a little crazy face, like, hey, serious i know i already showed this but i want to do it close up and i'm going to eat you you are currently being eaten face as far as hand well it does have a balloon that i uh, love this is perfect like it feels like a balloon you can squish it the tiniest bit doesn't sound like a balloon but that doesn't really matter um the wire bends the one thing is the tip of it doesn't stay white. I don't know if you guys can see that. But the more and more you use it, the more you... Um, for the balloon, they have like this... Only one hand. Um, they have a little thing. And at first, I, I couldn't get it in. But you just literally have to jam it in. And it does do it. As you can see, it looks pretty good. I would put it on the action figure, but I can't. Like, oh my god. It is literally the most frustrating. Like, that that's as far as you can get it in. and It, it, it takes no force to take it out, and it will naturally fall a lot. So, um, yeah. Um, let's put... I like the serious face a little bit. Honestly, I'm going to be honest. I think it's literally the most creepiest face. Because he's just being serious. Um, this does take a little bit of force to get on. Okay, so for articulation now. Side to side. Decent. Like, it's a little rough doing it. But that does feel like... An it action figure, I will say. Looks up, mm, not a lot. Looks down a lot, actually. Like come like really well. Um, so yeah, again, if you want more articulation on the head, just take this off. Um, the the NECA does a really good job on hiding their joints of the action figure. So this can go all the way around. All the way around. Um, you can turn it like this all the way around again. Um, single jointed. Can make them do this. Uh, pretty good. They can't go back, but eh, most things can't. This can turn a little bit. Don't suggest it. Um, yep. That's for the arms. For the for this, I uh, could do a little bit better. It can go a little bit forward, it can go back this much. I wish it could go back a little bit. It can it can turn. I wish they did a little bit differently, but this is fine. Um it can turn to like this. You can do this, but it looks kinda weird because uh, of these. Um as far as this, it is a single jointed leg. It can only go this much. Not a lot. Um can't go for, but th that's a to be expected. You can twist this. You can, yep. So that all turns. And f as far as the legs, you can bend this much, and you can bring it back this much. And a little bit of ankle pivot. I wish it did a little bit better, but that's fine. 
Um, yep, so that's it. And again, I'm gonna go through everything. Like, geez, like these look so good. Like, you cannot make this look better. I'm not even joking. I mean, just change the feet, make the hand, and make the hands just work. Like, you can put it on, maybe change the head just a little bit so you can swap in and out easier. But it's, it's pretty good. I'd be okay if it didn't have any changing. But the hands, I need that. I like, oh my god. And as far as the feet, it's livable, but it's, it's, uh, they're small in my opinion, right? Like, maybe long enough, but not thick enough. Like, they're very, yeah. So I have a little bit of, uh, gripes with this, um, and it's, uh, it's just so close to being an amazing figure. So close, but the hands, the hands, whoo, like, that was uh, so annoying in my opinion. Like, oh my god. So getting a ruler, um, he stands at... Um, about six, six and a half. Um, yep, six and a half. Leaning more towards six inches, but yeah, basically six and a half inches. Um, what do I rate this figure? Six out of ten, honestly. Um, it was so close to being an eight or a nine, guaranteed. Um, if they changed the hand so it could work... And it was on both. If just one of them was bad, okay. But both of them were bad. So I know it's just that. Like, the hands are just bad. If they change the hands and, like, you know, like, you know, inside of this so you could actually stick it in, I'd make it 8 out of 10. Um, if they made the feet better, 9 out of 10. Um, <laughs> it's uh, really unrealistic to have a 10 out of 10. Um, that would mean, like, having, like, insane, um, articulation, and it, does, it just doesn't really need that, you know what I mean? But it, it could. It definitely could, and that would be amazing. Um, but what I do like is literally even the hair looks good. It's just so close to being so perfect. So perfect. It is just so close. It's probably... I guarantee you it's the most, for me, it's the most annoying action figure I've ever gotten. I know I only do superheroes, but I had to do this. I love this action figure. I loved watching it. I was like, this is amazing. I'm going to get this. Uh, <clears throat> so close. So close. NECA, you are so close. <laughs> you are so close. Oh my god. But, yeah. So I do suggest this figure. It's actually a really good looking, like... It looks really good. Um, hopefully you guys have a better with the hand system, but what I did and what a lot of people have to do is get a hair dryer and just heat it up and then you can take off the hands. Like, I could not take off the hands, like, including other people. And, um, yeah. So, it's kind of annoying, but as far as looks, this looks amazing. I suggest it. I, I definitely suggest it. It costed around 50 bucks. Um, and, yeah, I would pay another $10, literally, I would pay another $10 just to get the hands working, but, yeah. So, this is, um, it figure next to her average figure, standing taller, I got Captain America, um, the other figures I reviewed, Iron Man, um, if you're wondering why he doesn't have his hand, the hand... Okay, the um, the little thing where you can move the hand broke off, right? But this, it's just jammed in there, the part of the hand. So the actual hand part, not the little tube thing that comes out. So I cannot get another hand in there and I cannot take it out. It's just FYI for people, but yep, that's the average scale. I suggest this figure. It looks amazing as a display figure. Put it up for display. This is amazing. For doing stop motion, anything like that. If you're going to put it in crazy positions. It, it's so close to being an amazing and perfect figure. 
that is my rating, guys. Again, 6 out of 10, honestly. The hands are such an important part. The feet, the feet do factor in. I wish the torso did a little bit better. And the head. The head for switching in and out. Um, this is the figure with the, um... With the... Uh... Oh, by the way, this is what it looks like with... The, so it looks a little bit weird, but again, um, for some people, that'll actually be really cool. So yeah, it's supposed to have it, but honestly, it looks really cool with that. I'm definitely not going to display it like that, but come on, that looks cool with that. But just to put it on, you can't like put it on after... I mean, you can do this if you want, but then he won't really be that scary anymore. <laughs> but, uh, well, yeah. I actually watched the movie. It was really good. Um, yeah. Um, so you do have to put it on a little bit. Like, if you go like this, it's not right. You have to go like this, okay? Like, there's a specific side, just FYI. Oh. So yeah, it, it does take a little bit of effort, but it's alright. I wish it could be changed a little bit. A lot of people don't know that you have to get a hairdryer every once in a while for these action figures. And for some people, they might just refund it. They might just bring it back. Because you can refund things on Amazon. If I were you, I'd get this on Amazon. It's a good site. So yep, that's it. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> Again, um, maybe fix this, just a little bit more articulation in the legs. Um, this has mainly been a negative video, but <laughs> I want it to be positive, I really do, but like, it's, it's, uh, like, picking it up, this looks like an amazing thing, but really, I really hope you enjoyed the video, um, review slash video thing, um, I hope you thought it was necessary to watch it because you might might have maybe gotten it. Uh, I mean, I m honestly might pick a two pack, like like forty dollar of another figure for this. Like for the for the amount of money, I would I would have suggested, but you could just get two other action figures. And I think that'd be more worth it. So is this worth it? No, uh, sadly not. <laughs> Sadly, sadly, sadly not. Um, but yeah, that's it. Bye.